Hi guys, and welcome to another submission video. There's going to be plenty of them this month. Uh, we've got a lot of cards in front of us, so how about we get started with these from Josh. We have a Charizard base set to begin our journey on submissions today. Uh, and guys, just the vast amount of cards that are in front of me for this video. It's going to be a long one. Um, so yeah, many thanks guys for sending in all these cards. Uh, it would be really good going through them. I don't know where you're finding... First edition, what's he? Team Rocket, no matter the condition uh, at the moment. Him on top, no, no cards or, or even Pokemon that's loved very much, I don't think. Um, personal favourite card of mine um, from Neo Discovery, Mischievous, Charizard from Evolutions now. Tom was telling me how I'm going to find it struggling because we obviously upgraded our setup here. Not for you guys, like, it's very similar for you guys. But we've upgraded our setup in terms of the PC and monitor. And to the monitor to the right of me, Wow, they look crisp. Um, they look absolutely brilliant. So if you are watching this in 4K, which you can do, um, then yeah, you're probably seeing how just good and gorgeous these cards look from Josh. Uh, Rocket, Sneak Attack, and Rainbow Energy. Oh, there we go. That's a beautiful card to continue on our journey with. We've got the Dark Raichu, uh, Neo Genesis. Neo Genesis first edition, very, very difficult to grade, guys. Um... My third PSA returns ever is the one which is like my worst returns ever. You're not obliged to watch. And that is because I was naive enough to try and grade a first edition Neo Genesis set. And that was silly of me because these cards are very, very difficult to grade. Uh, Steelix, Togetic, Typhlosion, the big boy everyone keeps talking about. Uh, number 18, the one that kind of just gets overlooked nowadays. Yamma, a very, very difficult card to collect in first edition. Um, it's got a very, very low pop. Uh, Neo Discovery, we've got the Umbreon. It's a gorgeous card, that one, isn't it? With a big, big, bright moon behind it. Smurgle doing some sort of painting. Scizor, Polyrath first edition, Polytoad first edition, Magnemite, Kabutops. Uh, slashy Kabutops, looking very cool. Houndoom, definitely should be looking at the camera more though, shouldn't I? Fortress and the Espeon. Beautiful, beautiful submission there, Josh. So many thanks. Uh, and yeah, James is up next with a gorgeous boss's orders. I really do like this card, to be fair. Um, the Hyper Rare really looks great. Uh, Hidden Fates, of course. Didn't take us long to get back into that, did it? Articuno Fossil, uh, Zapdos Fossil, Dragonite Fossil. Again, we are just seeing so many more, I guess, unlimited Watsy cards. Uh, I think that's where a lot of new collectors are going, Unlimited Watsy, because they still want the same cards, they just don't have the first edition stamp. It'd be interesting to see how Unlimited Watsy grades, because obviously they've been in the binders that much longer. Uh, but many thanks, James. Harry is up next, starting off with a Mega Neo, Neo Genesis. We then have Mischievous. Shining Gyarados now from Neo Revelation. Beautiful card. Raikou from Neo Rev. Venusaur base set 2. Ho Ho from Neo Revelation. Shining Tyranitar from Neo Destiny. Beautiful cards. Thank you, Harry. Steven, you are up next. Starting off with a Lieutenant Surge's Fero First Edition. Gorgeous card. Uh, Erica's Dragonair from Gym Heroes. Eevee and Pikachu play fighting. Birthday Pikachu now. And, oh, I absolutely love that promo. The black and white Pikachu promo. Uh, so many thanks, Stephen. Nyoki is up next. Dark Dragonite first edition. Team Rocket. Beautiful card. Altaria now from Triumphant. Rapidash from Triumph. See, these are the sorts of cards I think, and the primes, of course, I think we're going to see more and more uh, submitted because, you know, these cards, they're, they're still quite cheap on the open market. Uh, Dark Ray and Cressella Legend. I absolutely love the Legend cards. These ones aren't cheap. I think mean, Unlisted Leaf did a video about them and the prices went mad. Uh, Typhlosion First Edition Neo Genesis. If you've got one of those, you submit it at the moment. That seems to be the plan for everyone. Zapdos Aquapolis. Feraligator from Expedition. Flareon First Edition. Jolteon First Edition. Kangaskhan from Japanese Jungle. Wash Rotom. Cracked Ice Reverse Foil. Really nice to see. And a Koga's Ditto First Edition. Many thanks, Naoki. Yusuf is up next. And you have sent in a big stack of cards. More than this as well. Uh, your Dragon Ball Super now. Really cool cards. Seeing them gain, gain, and gain popularity. I kind of felt like it was falling off. But then, I think the last month or two, we've just received loads and loads of submissions again. Uh, Miraculous Fighter SS3 Go Gitter. Beautiful Hyper Rare cards. The rarity on these cards is, oh, look how good they look. Big, bright green there. Hopefully they're green anyway, because I'm actually colorblind. 
So I might have just told you all a lie. Uh, Universe 7, Saiyan Prince Vegeta. Uh, so we have found that the signature cards are more difficult to get the tens on. Son Goku, the Awakened Pack. You really have got the best ones from that, haven't you? Um, and then we move on to the Yu-Gi-Oh! Left arm of the Forbidden One. Thousand Dragon, Trihorn Dragon. Uh, Blue Eyes White Dragon, of course. You can't have a Yu-Gi-Oh! submission without sending in the big Blue Eyes White Dragon. Uh, Charmander from Heal and Fate. Charmander again, Charmander again. Charmeleon, Charmeleon. Where's the Charizard? You can't have Charmanders and no Charizard. Latios GX, Tapu Bulu. Two gold there. Uh, Scizor GX, Scizor GX, Umbreon GX, Glaceon GX, Espeon GX, SM210, Reshiram, Ho-Ho, Articuno, Electrode. What else we got? The Latias and Latios. This is like the alternative art where they're making their love sign shape. Uh, and we have two big cards now. We have Unbroken Bonds, Hyper Rare, Reshiram, and Charizard. I'll tell you, use of submission does not end there because we have some beauties in here. Uh, including a few gold stars, a Latias gold star, a Latios gold star, Shining Gyarados. Um, so I've been told by Yusuf that these Shining cards are in pretty good condition. Um, I, don't, I think they're not getting their hopes up too much, and I don't think we will be either. We'll just have to see how they do. But we're, we're hoping, we're hopeful, we're always hopeful for everyone that they get the grades they desire. Uh, Shining Nottel now... Um, Shiny Not Tell. Shiny Not Tell was a weird one in first edition because it was the cheapest for a long time, but it was very hard to acquire because no one would sell it because they all believed it was undervalued, even though on auctions it sold for the same price. It's very weird. Um, we have a lot of EX era cards now, and they are EXs. So we don't see these overly often, especially in near mint to mint condition. Um, so I'm sure there'll be plenty of interested people uh, watching this submission video to see what um, see what these get. Well, they'll probably be, be even more interested in the returns, let's be honest. Uh, Typhlosion, Raichu from EX Sandstorm, Whale Lord, Kabutops as well. Uh, we have the Typhlosion EX from Unseen Forces. Unseen Forces, the EXs are so expensive. Um, whether it's because of low pop or whatever, but they are just crazy expensive. Two Tyranitars now. I mean, wherever you've got them from, even if you could pull one gem out, but even mid nines and mid eights are going for stunning amounts of value. Uh, Ball Rain EX, Dustox EX, Mighty Yenna, of course, Wigglytuff from EX Hidden Legends, Reggie Ice from EX Emerald, Electro DX, EX Fire Red Leaf Cream. It's like a little pop quiz, isn't it? Like, if I can guess what the uh, set is from the EX era. Of course, this is Power Keepers. This is a set I do have in PSA 10. Um, it was the set I bought basically to start off my EX journey um, in PSA 10s. Seems like a lot of other people had the same idea because, you know, well, everyone knows now the price is rocketed and I'm just glad I got the Power Keepers and I just need the Blastoise and Gengar EX, which I can't see here, Yusuf. So I'm a bit disappointed because these cards do look very good indeed. Uh, Delcati Groudon EX from EX Crystal Guardians. That is an EX card I do have. I do, I think. I must do. There's not many Groudons I'm missing, to be fair. Skeptile EX, apart from when it's brand new. To be fair, when it is brand new, you guys just um, always send them to me as a gift and, and I grade them and one gets a 10 and it sticks in my collection. Uh, Dragonite EX, Flygon EX, Flygon EX, our oh, beauties. Um, Kingdra EX, Rayquaza EX, Lightning type, Delta Species. Big fan of the Delta Species personally and that just looks amazing. Latios EX, Water type. Uh, Latias, Fire Type, Agron from EX Fire Keepers, and of course, Ruby and Sapphire, Aron. Many thanks, Yusuf. Matthew, you are up next, and you're starting off with a Steelix from Skyridge, uh, Kabutops as well, Politoed from beautiful cards. These are all the hollows. Uh, well, not all the hollows, obviously, because there's 32 of them, but nine hollows. It's pretty good going. Umbreon Aquapolis, uh, Arbok Expedition. And a Zapdos Unlimited. Many thanks, Matthew. Nick, you are up next. And Nick, you are starting off. What is it with Neo Genesis at the moment? Everyone seems to be wanting to submit it. Uh, Azumarill, Lieutenant Surge's Fero. You guys are all going after cards that are hard to grade, man. Uh, we have the Mr. Gyarados Gym Challenge. Lapras VMAX, that big boy hyper rare. Sweet Coon from Neo Revelation. Dark Blastoise from Team Rocket. Neo Genesis uh, Typhlosion. Blaine's Moltres, beautiful card. Really difficult to grade that one. 
Uh, Venusaur from Baser, Espeon from Near Discovery, Giovanni's Nido King, the Dark Charizard from Team Rocky, and the Erica's Clef Fable. Many thanks, Nick. Jason of Rockmander on Instagram is our next lucky submitter. We have Umbreon GX, Sylveon GX, Leafeon GX, Glaceon GX, Celebi Crystal Card. What a beauty. Uh, and the Ho Ho as well. Lugia from Neo Genesis. Charizard Reverse Foil Fireworks. Charizard from Expedition. Another beautiful one. Charizard Reverse Foil. Big Boy Charizard GX from Burning Shadows. Obviously, the original OG of the Hidden Fates version. Bulbasaur now. Uh, Rayquaza GXs. I'm going to guess a few of them are promos. Uh, that they are. I'd imagine you would have opened those up. And we have Tag Team All-Stars cards. To be fair, I'm not. I'm surprised we haven't seen more and more of Tag Team All-Stars. It was a great, great set to open. Gyarados GX with Crimson Invasion. Ditto. Moltres, Zapdos and Articuno. Solgaleo GX. Solgaleo GX. Wow, a few of those. Uh, Moltres, Zapdos and Articuno. Charmander. We've seen a lot of this little guy. Uh, and the Charmeleon. Politoed First Edition. Raichu from Base Set. Nine Tails as well. We got the Charmeleon, the Pikachu, uh, Charmander. We have what else? We got Squirtle, Pikachu, Rayquaza GX, of course. And then we have some newer cards. So these are from Rebel Clash. Well, that one card was from Rebel Clash. The Dene GX Tag Team All Stars, Mew from CP6, and Mew from Oaken Bro Unbroken Bonds. Is it just me, or have they really been printing out amazing looking Mews recently? Ancient Mew, Dedene GX, Mega Blastoise EX from Evolutions, Charizard from Base Set, Team Rocket Dark Charizard, Jirachi GX, Mewtwo Tag Team, uh, Moltres Zapdos, Moltres Zapdos, Mr. Gibble, Mr. Gabite, and Mr. Chomp, and the big free legendary birds, Hyper Res. Many thanks, Jason, or Rockmander on Instagram. Go check it out. My apologies, Jason, is not done yet. We have a Mario Pikachu. Uh, the Full Art as well, Psyduck, um, uh, SM promo. Oh, well, that's just a Pokemon card on the back, so we'll see how that goes. We've got a Mewtwo stamp promo, Electable stamp promo, Venusaur EX Crystal Guardians Dark Alakazam, Reshiram Black and White promo, uh, Cynthia Lycanroc GX, Lycanroc GX, Scizor GX, Espeon GX. Of course, we were going to see this much hidden fate. Ancient Origins Lugia EX, beautiful card. Uh, Squirtle First Edition Charmeleon, Ho Ho GX, Cyndaquil uh, Neo Genesis Charmander, loads of the Charmanders and Charmeleons going in. Um, I don't particularly know why. Maybe there's just been a lot of sales, or maybe there's just not available on eBay. Mewtwo GX, Electrode from Jungle, uh, Dragonite First Edition, Flareon, Lapras, Psyduck SM Promo, uh, a few of those as well. Many thanks, Jason at Rotmanda. Nathan is up next, and that is Rising Sun Collectibles on Instagram. Uh, I believe we have plenty of Japanese cards to go through. So we got Giovanni's Gym just seems so, so popular, like, all the time. Versus Cirrus's Pikachu, uh, Articuno, Moltres, and Zapdos. I really do love those holophiles, to be fair. The Mew, Misty's Tears, of course, ever popular card. Sabrina's Gaze, obviously, the band card. Uh, Moo Moo Milk. Grimer, the band card again, Typhlosion, Lugia, Charizard GX Ultra Shiny, a couple of those. No, very, very strong submission this. Uh, Charizard Neo 2 promo, we've got the Blange Charizard, a few of those, and a load of those actually. Dark Charizard, Dark Charizard, 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 just Charizards. There's nothing wrong with just submitting Charizards, I would I would say anyway, plenty of those. Charizard of Brex and GX, look at the colours, they're amazing. Reshiram and uh, Charizard GX. We've got the two versions there, which look pretty good together. Charizard V. I'd imagine we'd see this big boy Charizard V Max. Can't wait for Darkness Ablaze to start to seeing some of those cards coming through. Definitely can't wait until we get the first return of those. It's going to be gorgeous looking cards. Venusaur now. Mewtwo. Steelix promo. Dragonite Game Boy promo. A couple of those. Rainbow Energy Verse series. Rayquaza. Blaine's Arcanine, a couple of those, and Giovanni's Gyarados. Many thanks, Nathan. Rising Sun Collectibles on Instagram. Kevin is actually going to start off his submission with a load of sealed promos. So the Ancient Muse uh, from the German release, which is cool to see. Uh, but then we move on to German Yu-Gi-Oh. Love this card. Love the colours. Dark Magician Girl now. Mashamp First Edition. 
Mash Out First Edition. Raw Nona, obviously German-based set and German cars in general are very popular at the moment. We're seeing more and more of them coming through. Uh, German Yu-Gi-Oh obviously does get recognised by PSA. Uh, and the rest at the moment don't, but we will be working on that with them. The Pikachu now, Nido King, Dark Arbok, Volnona, Mewtwo, Stamp Promo, Iron Man. Oh, they look wicked. Uh, Avengers uh, 4. Oh, this is going to be good. I am gonna can't wait to see those encapsulated. Of course, we've got the stickers now, so we do know those get encapsulated for sure. The Pikachu tops, Nido King, Gyarados, Mewtwo. Oh, what is this one? Uh, this is Merlin Collection. We've had a few questions about these, actually. Um, and from far as we can tell, I don't think there'll be a problem to submit at all. Uh, Merlin is a recognised, um, you know, supplier of these goods. Uh, and then we have Dark Hypno, Mashup Mate, and Turtle. Many thanks, Kevin. Nathan, you are up next with our first sports card submission of this video. We got the Lionel Messi prisms, Cristiano Ronaldo prisms, of course, the two best players, arguably, on the planet. Cup captains, they definitely have been uh, the past decade. Marcus Rashford, uh, Donovan, uh, that's pretty cool, actually. I like that. Um, and we got Didier Drogba, obviously a brilliant player, and Buffon as well. I think he's still playing between the sticks, but many thanks, Nathan. Philip is up next, and Philip starts off with a beautiful Leafy on level X card. Again, level X cards are cards I'm expecting to see more and more come through the service. They're just a bit more affordable uh, than EXs, especially now. Your EV Munch, uh, your Alone Ninetales GX, Umbreon GX, EV, uh, Ultra Shiny GX. Um, plenty of beautiful cards here. It'll be interesting to see how Ultra Shiny does perform against Hidden Fates. At the moment, Hidden Fates, I think, is a winning by far. Love this Suicune card. I think I do want that in my collection one day. Raikou, Dialga, Palkia, Deoxys. Um, what else do we have? Kyogre. I mean, it's okay. Flareon, Gold Star, Skamori EX from Power Keepers. A couple of those. Blaine's Moltres from Gym Challenge. What else do we have? Wobbuffet from Neo Discovery. And this Tyranitar EX from EX Unseen Forces. Many thanks, Philip. Matthew or at Dead Eye Mud is next up on Instagram. So guys, go and check that out. First edition Zapdos, first edition Slowpoke and Slow Bro. The Omnite there. Sea Drac, I can never say that word. Shelder first edition. Again, I think we'll see a lot more uh, first edition non hollows. I've been considering whether I should collect uh, Team Rockets or what's the uh, Gym Heroes or Neo Destiny. Just to like be make the set bigger. Neo Destiny would be great. I wish. I did have a few full sets of Near Destiny 1st Edition, and I kind of regret getting rid of the PSA 10s now, to be honest. Uh, Blaine's Moltres, Misty's Golduck, uh, Erica's Venusaur, Giovanni's Gyarados, Giovanni's Persian, Rocket's Moltres, Rocket's Hitmonchan, and the Snorlax from Jungle. Last but not least, Reshiram and Charizard, full art. Many thanks, Matthew. Andrew, you are up next with some reverse foils from Evolutions. Now you have your Masham, the big boy Charizard. And the big boy Charizard. Many thanks, Andrew. Julian is up next. And Julian, you have a Chanira first edition and a Zapdos first edition. So many thanks for submitting with Grady Gem. Mark, you are up next. And you are starting off with a Charizard base set, Chansey base set, and ending on the Hitmon Chan. Many thanks, Mark. We then have Rich or Rex1987 UK on the Instagram. So guys, go and check it out. Charizard GX, Charizard GX SM211. Uh, the Zacian V from Sword and Shield, Zamazenta V. If um, Sun and Moon is anything to go by, Sword and Shield will just get more popular as time goes on. Um, it didn't do particularly well. Well, it might have done. Who knows? Uh, but it didn't do particularly well for grading. Um, Mew, Mewtwo, Dedene from Unbroken Bonds, Charizard GX, Full Art, beautiful card, Mega Charizard EX, Charizard and Brexen, the three Hyper Rare Birdies and Ancient Mew. Many thanks, Rich. Lee, or Lucky Lee Plays, is up next. We have Ancient Mew, Ancient Mew, Ancient Mew, Ancient Mew. Charizard, reverse fall. Oh, Ancient Mew, Ancient Mew. Ah, oh, there we go. On to a Dragonite EX. Big boy card. Pikachu from Cosmic Eclipse. I'm a big fan of Cosmic Eclipse full art. Uh, I, I do need to get them into the collection because I keep saying I'm going to keep buying them. Um, and I really do just need to go ahead and do that. Mash out first edition. Charizard reverse foil. Charizard hollow. Mega Blastoise EX, Mega Venusaur, Mega Charizard, Grookey, and Psyduck Reverse Foil from Cosmic Eclipse as well. Beautiful cards. Many thanks, Lee. 
Francisco is up next. We have Whis, Celestial Moderator. So Francisco is a big submitter and collector of Dragon Ball Super cards. Uh, got 100 cards back not too long ago. Uh, God Ceiling Technique. Going all out. Go Tanks. Shenron now. Go Jika. Go Jita. Vegeta. Zeno. Cosmic Unison. Uh, you could probably tell. Never really been massive into Dragon Ball personally. Uh, but I know a few people who are. Um, and they just basically tell me it's a massive brawl. Um, and I think the good guy wins almost every time. Uh, I think it's this guy, Son Goku. Mass Saiyan, Archive Absorption, Parapatora, uh, Body Baby Janamet. That's a weird looking baby. The guy is massive. Uh, Son Goku and Vegeta, Apex of Power. So it looks like they're going to go kick ass together. Son Goku, the Awakened Power. Uh, so these are the rarer cards now, the signature cards. Bardock, Wheel of Iron. I like that guy. He looks really cool. Uh, Ribrion, Awakened Warrior, Bardock. Bardock, the Progenator. The Pendable Brother. Really does try and get my pronunciation so wrong. And it's so good to say them. Android 18, Absolute Release Ball. And Nappa, Demolition Man. Many thanks, Francisco. Alex, you are up next. You've got Mega Tokyo Pikachu. Uh, Pikachu promo, another Pikachu promo now. Oh, obviously a big fan of the Pikachu promos. It would see Rowlet, um, what they called Poncho Pikachu. Shabuas Pikachu with the graffiti spray and the comedians as well. I do like this cheeky Pikachu. Many thanks, Alex. Michael is up next, starting off with a hockey card. We then have basketball. Basketball again with the fire, which I always love to see. Uh, Michael Jordan. We have Ray Allen. And Payton as well. Just in case you start to get worried that the rest of your cards aren't here. 2017 to 2020 cards are in a different video. So many thanks, Michael. Cine is next. And Eggzini. Uh, Cine always sends in the most beautiful card. Uh, Latias from Delta Species and Latio. So I, there, there seems to be a hollow theme deck card for this card that I now need. Because I've got the rest of the Delta Species. Apart from the Pikachu as well. So I, I got that Mew after 5 million years. Uh, now I need to go after two even rarer holofoils. Uh, we got Salamance V, Salamance V Max, uh, Rayquaza EX. There's the V Max. Sorry, spoke ahead of time. Sylveon EX, Mewtwo GX, uh, Dratini tops Dratini again. Oh, there we go. The amazing rare Rayquaza. Doesn't that just look brilliant? Alola Nine Tails GX, Gardevoir V, Flygon, Charizard V Max, of course, and a Charizard V. Many thanks, Cine. Beautiful cards. Jaden, you're up next. Just with the one card, it is Charizard base set. So thanks very much, Jaden. Samuel, you are up next. And you are starting off with an Alakazam, Alakazam base set. Charizard, a Venusaur base set. We have a Clefable from Jungle. Jolteon as well. Snorlax from Jungle. Dragonite first edition fossil. Team Rocket. Team Rocket again. Uh, Houndor. Neo Discovery. Ampharos from Neo Rev. And a Mewtwo. Black Star promo. Beautiful cards. Many thanks, Samuel. Matt, you are up next. You have a Metagross EX from Hidden Legends. A Regice Gold Star. Beautiful card. Deoxys EX. A Shining Magikarp. And a Bliss EX from Unseen Forces. Many thanks, Matt. We have another Matthew now. There seems to be just an abundance of Matthews, so I do apologise. Must be finding it difficult to find your submissions. Uh, Charizard from Base Set. That's going to be interesting. Uh, Rapidash Reverse Foil. Zapdos Fossil. Vaporeon from Aquapolis, uh, Skyridge, sorry, Alakazam, Alakazam, and uh, Steelix. So many thanks, Matthew. Another Matthew up next. However, we can differentiate because it's alpha underscore cards on the Instagram. So guys, go and check that out. We've got the Builder Bear Workshop, Squirtle, Charmander, uh, the Alone Vulpix Toys are Rush, the Shining Mew from Shining Legends. The Espeon Poncho EV Shining Mew again. Shining Mew 2. No, not really. Shining Rayquaza. And the Moltres Zapdos and Articuno GX from SM210. Many thanks, Matthew or Alpha underscore cards. Joe, you are up next with Sylveon GX from Hidden Fates. Misty's Determination from Evolutions and Brock's Grit. Uh, Charizard from Evolutions. Uh, we have the Aerodactyl pre-release. So this is the brown stamp version this time around. Rayquaza GX, Shining Rayquaza. Obviously a Rayquaza fan. Togetic um, E4 for Alligator. So these are from the Neo Premium farm. Well, no, they're not. Uh, Raikou and Clefable EX. Many thanks, Joe. Christian is up next. Starting off with a Jirachi. Amazing rare. Uh, and then this Blastoise Prism, which is really cool as well. So thank you for your submission to Grady Jen.
Josh or Joshua is up next and a big submission last month. So we've got a few cards for this month. Uh, Kadabra, Mashamp and Squirtle. So many thank you, Josh. James is up next and that is Pokemon underscore card underscore stall underscore stall on the Instagram. So guys, go check it out because we have a lot of those Charizard V Maxes. I'd imagine we're going to have a lot of the Charizard Vs as well, which we do. Uh, we then have the Charizard from Evolutions, the Reverse Foil. Zaki and V, full art, really do like that. The Mew from Tag Team All-Stars, Rayquaza GX, Solgaleo GX, SM Promo, and the Lunana. we got the Jirachi Tag Team All-Stars, Raichu EX, Fire Red Leaf Green, Pikachu, and Zekrom GX, and Cyndaquil First Edition Neo Genesis. Many thanks, James. Gioli is up next. Again, I, I do apologise if I'm pronouncing that incorrect. Uh, these index tabs, unfortunately, are covering... Most of the players face. Not there. That is Messi. So we've got some Messi cards. Messi with a chopped off head. Uh, two Messi stickers. Three Messi stickers. Kylian Mbappe and Courtois Gien. Uh, so these are very, very popular. They have two versions. We've got the Campio and Campi on. Uh, apologies. Another post-it note there. Uh, we got this. Really cool. So you've got the left-hand side and the right-hand side. So it's almost like a big promo. Uh, more FC Barcelona players. So that's Samuel Eto. I believe Ronaldinho, of course, the iconic player. He was. He could just do things that other players I've never seen even attempt. Uh, Messi, 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 Messi seems to be the reoccurring theme there. Uh, plenty more Messi as well. Wow, beautiful. The great submission. Many thanks, Gioli. Peter is up next with Blastoise CD promo, Venusaur CD promo, Charizard CD promo, the Bennett EX. I don't see that very often. Right, EX Legend Maker, Dark Dragonite, Lugia from EX Unseen Forces, and Lucario GX. Many thanks, Peter. Philip or Pokelax is up next. We've had a lot of sub dealings between ourselves over years now, it must be, uh, which is crazy to think how long the service has been around. So, really do appreciate you again trusting us with these beautiful cards. Look at that. Um, Jinx with a Christmas hat on. That's very odd. Uh, going for a swim on their raft. Bulbasaur and Ash Charmander. The rest of them, not sure if they want to go delve deeper into that cave, just in case a Tyranitar or Snorlax comes out of it. Blastoise hiding in his shell. Obviously, there's a Venusaur about. Uh, Gyarados Mecha, which is pretty cool. Uh, Gyarados again. These really do look good. They're, they're good, playful. They're fun. Something a bit different to collect. And they're not something that you see every day as well. So you can you can say, oh, look, look at my unique collection, which I think is always a winner, realistically. Um, Jigglypuff, we've got the Bulbasaur and Pikachu, a couple of those. We've got Gary showing off all his gym badges. Uh, what else is going on? Giovanni, what's he got? Oh, he's going against Armored Mewtwo for some reason. Pidgeotto doing some sort of swirl. Brock probably creeping out the pro Pokemon. Mr. Mime. So, yeah, that's a really, really nice set of cards there, Philip. So, thank you for submitting those. Slow King, first edition. Magneton, Lieutenant Surge's Magneton. Brock's Ride On, Jim Heroes, Lieutenant Surge's Electabuzz, Erica's Vileplume, Misty's Tentacruel, a couple of those. Dark Arbok from Team Rocket, Dark Magneton, Dark Weezing, Dark Dugtrio now, Dark Golbat. We got the Dark Arbok again, Dark Hypno, Magneton from Fossil, Charizard, Houndoom, Aquapolis, Expedition, Mashamp. Espeon, Espeon, uh, Aquapolis, Tyranitar, Charizard GX, Shining Celebi, SM Promo, Suicune, Celebi, Eevee Munch, Rowlet Munch, Psyduck Munch, uh, Eevee Munch, Rowlet Munch, Psyduck Munch, yet again. Very, very big cards at the moment. Um, you know, they've gone up in value considerably since they released. Only a year, last year, was it? Or was it the year before? Team uh, Aqua's Kyogre, obviously, I much prefer the Groudon. So where is he, Philip? That's not acceptable. Um... Jolteon EX, Kingdra EX, Sharp Mega Sharpedo EX. That's cool, actually. I do like that. Uh, Pidgeot EX again. The Pikachu promos, a couple of those with Kecleon. Shaman looking very cute. Skeptar. No, it's not Skeptar. Oh, I can't remember his name now. Regigas. There he is. Uh, but yeah, guys, that was Philip. That was Pokelax. Many thanks. James is up next, starting off with a Mega Venusaur EX. X, uh, Charizard Reverse Foil, a few of those. Then the Charizard Hollow Foil from Evolutions. Uh, beautiful, beautiful cards. The Clefairy. I think it will be interesting to see if we do see more of these Hollow Foil types uh, from Evolutions coming through. Not Hollow Foil types, like the, the Hollow Foils and the Reverse Foils. 
Evolution just has so much in the set that is brilliant. Uh, there's not a lot of components that are bad. I don't think there is any components that are bad, to be honest. You've got the secret rares, the different sort of cards. Maybe the break cards. I mean, you could argue, yeah, maybe probably the break cards. There, there's the bad component. Oh, sorry. Sorry, James. Uh, Venusaur EX, Mega Blastoise EX. But otherwise, look. Gorgeous. Uh, Fire Energy, Reverse Foil, Charizard EX, Mega Charizard, Mega Charizard, the big boy Mega Charizard, Marnie Hyper Rare, Bosses Hyper Rare, beautiful cards. We then have the Ancient Mew, a few of those, Jinx, First Edition, Staryu, Doduo. Um, so I believe after this, we just have a nice kick. Oh, base set, First Edition, which is always good to see, isn't it? Um, Sand True, Vulpix, Bulbasaur, Kakuna. That is obviously not... Uh, base set first edi edition. So again, we have some more of the Dragon Ball Super cards. Uh, Son Goku, the adventure begins. After Image Technique, Son Goku, Ultra Instinct, Hit Pride, SS2 Trunks. Uh, back on to. Oh, so we're on to German base set first edition now. So, James, where did you pick these up from? Uh, Glue Manda, uh, Toromato, Tangela, Bissasam, Shillock. Shiggy, Bissasam, Dodu, Nebulak, Parenta, Bissanosp, and Shiggy. Another stack here now from James. We're going to start off with the Volnona first edition, the Zapdos. Uh, moving on to Poliwag, or the Quiddle Quapsu, Rupu, Capitope, Tubesy, Dodu, Nebulak, uh, Hornleo, Onyx, Quapsal again, Nido, Ran, Smogun, Tubsy, Quapsal, Vulpix, Nido, Ran, Safcon, Vulpix, Nebulak. I mean, I'm getting quite good at the pronunciations. Of the German first edition names. If you are German, then please let me know if I'm absolutely talking rubbish. And actually, my pronunciation skills are absolutely awful. Uh, Bissasam, Porygon. We've got the Dugong instead of Dugong, Magma, and Tubesy. Starmie is our next guy who's up on the list. We have the Shiggy, Glumanda, Bissasam, Glumanda, Glutexo, Bissasam, Mashok, Apollo. It just creates that basis for the hobby in Germany, for sure. When you have all of these first edition German cards, uh, it'll invite new collectors in. You can start to pick up these cards and be like, oh, cool, I've got the base set first edition. Because the hobby will move on uh, over the next five years to ten years in Germany. Obviously, it's still playing a little bit of catch up in the English market in the US and the UK. However, I, I personally don't see why not eventually it could reach those heights. You just need to engage more and more people in Germany. And even now... The stuff is so expensive um, in comparison. The odd thing is with the booster boxes over there, I mean, if you don't mind me saying, is that they are still incredibly expensive, but you can't PSA grade them currently. Like, that makes not a lot of sense to me. Like, you would have thought the value would have come from PSA grading. Maybe it's from the eventual value of PSA grading. I don't know. Or maybe they're just, they have the value themselves because people want the booster boxes uh, sealed up. That probably sounds more likely anyway guys uh that was james's submission and what a submission it was so many thanks james for choosing graded gem to uh submit those Elias is up next starting off with a raichu first place the charmander promo now groudon ex that's always good to see mewtwo ex the skeptile and the mewtwo ex again many thanks Elias. jordan you are up next starting off with a mr mime gx charizard gx sm211 Mewtwo and then Mew, Mew Reverse Foil Evolutions, Mewtwo EX, Mewtwo Rev SM Promo, Ancient Mew, Mew. I think you might be a Mew slash Mewtwo collector, Jordan. Uh, but yeah, beautiful cards. Many thanks, Jordan. Hi there, Jeremy. Uh, we have got lovely, lovely Magic the Gathering cards. I do apologize for the gap in knowledge of Magic the Gathering. Uh, unholy Strength um, and Safe Scape Zombies. Dragonite EX now, uh, Entei Reverse Foils, always a few of those to go in. Dark Magneton, which is then the first edition. Oh, that, I could have done like a split where it like morphed into the first edition. Dark Charizard, Mewtwo Hollow, Shining Gyarados from Neo Revelation, Lugia. Blaine's Moltres, Jim, Dark du uh, just Dugtria, not Dark Dugtria. Why is it? Has he done something wrong? Charizard, the Stained Glass Hollow, Giovanni's Exile, Magneton, Shiny Vault, Magnazone. Glaceon GX, Tapu Coco GX, Suicune Verse Series, Suicune Lost Thunder, Suicune GX, uh, the Full Art, and then the Hyper Air. Many thanks, Jeremy. Emil is up next, starting off with the Dark Kadabra First Edition. Dark Flareon Engulfed in Flames, Abra, Squirtle, Dark War Turtle, Dark Slowbro, Rayquaza GX, the couple of those, Lunana, the Moltres Zapdos, and Articuno Stained Glass, Solgaleo. 
the Pikachu Articuno GX, Moltra Sapdos SM210, Pikachu, Pikachu, Armored Mewtwo, Mewtwo GX, Dark Golbat, Charmander, Dark Magneton, Glaceon GX, SM226, Charizard GX again, the Ancient Mew, Greninja from Unbroken Bonds, Snorlax, Lugia GX, Lost Thunder, Charizard GX, Lugia, Neo Genesis, Articuno Legendary Collection, Light Dragonite, Houndor, Umbreon, Eevee GX, Eevee GX again, Mewtwo GX, another swirly Mewtwo. Mewtwo seems to be ever and ever more popular, doesn't it? Oh, and boom, we end on Charizard GX from Hidden Fates, of course. Many thanks, Emil. Jack, you are up next, starting off with a Charizard Evolutions, then the reverse for the Mega Charizard EX. Oh, a water tool, it's like a prism. Okay, we'll see how that goes. Uh, then we've got Friends. Oh, I'm just thinking of in-betweeners. Uh, Charizard whacking him in the face. War Turtle and Squirtle Squad Squirtle. Going out of Blastoise. Going somewhere. Uh, and then Pikachu and Ash, because they've just got a gym badge, which is really nice. So many thanks, Jack. Joe, you are up next. And that is Pokemon underscore Sphere. Uh, so these are some massive, massive submissions uh, that you have sent in. Everyone has just sent in so many cards, and we really do. Appreciate it at Graded Gem. Um, but Joe is one of those big, big submitters this month. We've got a lot of cards to get through. So a lot of CP6 now. Nine tails, nine tails, nine tails. Uh, probably will just skim through the duplications if that's okay. Well, no one's actually here to tell me it's not okay. So you guys can shut down the screen. No, it's not okay. Lots of Gyaradoses, but I can't hear you, unfortunately. So write in the comments. If you got this far, write in the comments. Um, recording time. We are on almost an hour and a half. I don't think the video will be that long. It's probably going to be like 50 minutes, something like that. Um, so, yeah, Chansey, Chansey, Need a King, Need a King, Polyrath, Polyrath, Polyrath. Obviously, these are all from CP6. These are all very popular cards at the moment. Uh, the Ekutukator, Rarachu GX, Mute Pokemon Breeder, Mewtwo GX, Entei GX, Full Art. Really looks great, to be fair. Uh, with the red on red contrast. Obviously, it's not contrasting if they're the same colours, but they're kind of different at the same time. Shining Rayquazas now. Where are you getting these from, Joe? Where? Where on earth are you getting, like, Shining cards from at the moment? They seem to be the most popular cards on the planet right now. Joe, that's your first stack. Now moving on to giant, giant stacks of Joe's cards. This is still Pokemon Sphere. Um, so, yeah, a lot of those we'll begin with. Um, we also have some some of, more of those promos as well. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Uh, okay, well, I think a lot of these are duplications. But they're like crazy duplications. Like, where are you getting all of these from? Uh, so, yeah, Blastoise and Piplup. I love Cosmic Eclipse. I need to just buy a boost case and open it all up, don't I? Uh, Mewtwo and Mew GX. Few of those now. The Pikachu and Zekrom GX. Another more beautiful, beautiful cards. Lugia GX and the Celebi and Venusaur. Blastoise and Piplup. Again, just crazy, crazy duplications. Uh, Dragonite GX, the Ancient Armored Mew. Ancient Armored Mew, that's interesting. Uh, Grumpy Charizard now. The Charizard EX, Charizard and Brexion, Charizard GX. Uh, Gurren Dive. Uh, Blastoise with Hydro Pump coming out. We've got the Dra uh, Charizard from Dragon Majesty. A few of those beauties. Uh, Charizard from SM9 as well. SM9, SM9, SM9. Charizard and Brexon GX. A load of those, to be fair. Uh, Charizard from Detective Pikachu. A load of those, to be fair. Charizard and Brexon. Good amount of those. Charizard VMAX. A couple of those. Uh, more of them. Dragonite GX, wow, wow, Dragonite GX, Dragonite GX Hyper Rare, uh, a lot of that is duplications as well, Charizard EX, beautiful, beautiful cards, Charizard from Neo 2 now, for Alligator, uh, Typhlosion, Typhlosion, Blastoise from Hydro Pump, from Hydro Pump, is Hydro Pumping, Blastoise GX, a few more of those, Charizard V now, beautiful cards, Reshiram and Charizard GX, more, more gorgeous, what, 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 where are you getting those from, Joe, I want your supplier, it is actually now the last stack for this submission video, so guys, if you have watched this entire video, then hats off to you for starters, um, but yeah, there is, 
these videos are going to be quite long this month. We are anticipating six or seven or eight um, to get them all out there. We have also decided to mix up the content. What we don't want to do is have submissions, 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 submissions for two weeks and then returns, 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 returns for two weeks. Our next deadline isn't until the end of August, so it just gives us a bit of breathing space to just spread out the submissions. So please don't worry if you see uh, these videos, any of these videos from this month, they would, have all, they would have all been, well, we are shooting them all basically within a two day period um, and your cards are going off to PSA as normal. So your cards will probably, especially for the latter cards, uh, in submission videos will already be at PSA by the time you see these videos, which is always good to see. Uh, Mewtwo EX, Mega Blastoise, Mega Charizard, Polyrath from Evolutions, Mew, and to end it, a Mash Amp. Guys, that was some epic sort of submission from Joe, uh, but from everyone, many thanks. There are so many more to come. Yeah, really looking forward to submitting these and then getting them back. That's the main thing, and we'll, we'll see how they do on the returns. I reckon that last submission might do. All right. Anyway, guys, many thanks. Like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, all the rest of it, and I'll, I'll see you soon.